talented fighter making the walk here tonight. I will be surprised, Joe, if we see him put on his back at any point tonight. Incredible takedown defense, great balance, very solid base, an outstanding sprawl that's very quick and athletic. And for a lot of fighters, they waste a lot of energy trying to bring this man down. Got to think the smart approach will be to see if you can get the shot early, but if it doesn't materialize, Go to plan B. This guy's takedown defense north of 90%. Some of the best takedown artists in the world have failed to take him down. This guy has insanely fast kicking speed and ridiculous leg dexterity. If you are close enough for him to kick you, you've got a real problem on your hands. to stand on a napkin in the center of the octagon and stand and trade with this young man, you're playing with fire. Frightening knockout power. Go look at the highlight reel. As good a reel as anybody in the sport, you can be sure he'll be looking to find a home for those heavy hands early and often. You do not want to get in a slugfest with this young contender, I can assure you of that. This guy has nasty chokes. His ability to cinch up a choke and finish it from any position is truly elite. the tape for this lightweight fight. More than five years apart, and they have the same height and reach. We send it inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC lightweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Manila, Philippines, Richie Ball. And now he his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a Muay Thai kickboxer and jiu-jitsu fighter, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, the great. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, third team. Herb Dean, third man in the octagon for this Ready, one. Ready. Ready. Well, always great to be back in the Pacific time zone. We get underway here at the Honda Center in Anaheim, California. Good to have you with us for a night of UFC action. We got tagged there. Oh. He's he is getting off some huge punches here. Good defense there. Oh! Nice leg kick. Lands a punch. Sound defensively blocks the shot. Going for the takedown here. Oh, gets the takedown there, Joe. That'll work. Switching stances here. Well, he gets cracked to the head there, Joe. He continues to be vulnerable by leaning in. He's almost moving into the strike at this point in time. You got to get that head off the center line. Nice body kick there. Oh, both men exchanged. Good combination. Nice defense there, huge block. Another shot lands upstairs. That one hurt. He's really, oh, he is in trouble.
danger right now. Deep danger. Oh! This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Both guys landed big oh, shots. Push him again. He's hurt. He's hurt. So, fighter a little bit stunned, holding on to He tagged him again. He's hurt. He's definitely rocked. Final seconds of round one. Oh, he got tagged again. He's hurt. Round two, round and down. All right, that one brings us to the end of the round. And now we will see what they can do in the corner, Joe, because the swelling on that fighter's eye is nothing if not significant. They'll get the end swell. There you go. They got it on there quickly. But I'm not sure he's going to be able to answer the bell here for this next round. Let's see. And here's another huge kick to the head that stuns his opponent. And here's one more kick to the head that stuns his opponent. Brittany Palmer in the building as usual. All right, here we go with round two. That last round was absolutely insane. Whoa! He is right. Nice leg kick. are coming, you know they're coming in bunches, and that was a near-perfect land. Nailed the target, full extension on the kick, and that's one of the better highlights we've seen here recently inside the octagon. Let's take a look at that again. Great angle here. Boom. So a huge result and a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the big knockout win. That could hold up as one of the better KOs of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, the referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest at 1 minute, 58 seconds of round number two. Playing the winner by knockout, Pitbull! So there he is, the man of the moment. Certainly maximized the showcase here tonight, Joey. Gets a big win by way of the knockout. Certainly kept the judges out of it here tonight. Perhaps some bonus money is coming his way, but there will be no wiping the smile off of his face tonight. He will party deep into the night with his friends, his family. A huge knockout turned in by that man here tonight. And he has set himself up for a huge fight now, moving forward inside the octagon.